ahead for us, getting ready for the World Championship. We're going to meet the local team of high school students who built a robot coming up. They'll show us how it works, a demonstration as well. And Troy's Take ABC7 is connecting you with events and people in our community. And for the first time ever, Chicago Math and Science Academy's high school robotics team will compete in the first Tech Challenge World Championships being held in St. Louis. Exciting times for them. Here to show us their design, the Robo Titans team. All the team members are joining us. So I want to specifically introduce Roshan Siddiqui. You could shake it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Roshan Siddiqui, he's one of the team members. Another team member is um, Abe Nazer Miketa, and their coach right here, Babek Guliev. Yeah. Guliev. Yes. So nice to have all of you here. Roshan, I want to start with you. Get us started on this. How does this actually work? It looks like you're playing a video game. Yeah, it's really much like a video game. So, um, so this year's challenge is called Cascade Effect, um, uh, where four robots are to play in each match in a 12 by 12 feet arena. And um, so there's a lot of uh, strategies and um, a lot of things going on in the game, such as uh, uh, picking up the scoring elements, which are the balls. So you can see picking, picking them up and uh, scoring them into the, into the rolling goals. This is the 60 centimeter rolling goal, um, so two points per centimeter. Um, this is the 90 centimeter rolling goal for three points per centimeter, and that's the 31 for one point per centimeter. Wow. And then here's the center goal for uh, uh, 480 points for four balls. And there it goes. Well, you continue to go ahead and let it do its thing. And Nasia, I just want to talk to you, because obviously this has to be definitely exciting, being part of the championships and being competitive in this arena. What does this project mean for you? Well, this project lets me enjoy, uh, have, it lets me have fun at the same, at the same time. I just learned that. I wouldn't learn in a normal, in, in a normal classroom. Uh, in class, I just sit down and get lectured by a teacher, but robotics lets me put my ideas at work, and I get to see them work. In, in a field. What do you think about going to the championship? Well, I'm very, very excited. This is the first time uh, in uh, CMSA robotics history, and uh, we're more than happy to see that a robot has succeeded and our ideas have been put to work. Babak, as a teacher and the co chair, this is what it's all about getting kids, getting students excited about science, about math, just everything. How complex is that project right there? I'm looking at it and thinking there's a lot of engineering involved. Yeah, first of all, I'm I'm very proud of my students because they advanced the work. And this program, robotics program, is an extracurricular activity at Chicago Math and Science Academy. And that's called FTC program, stands for Plastic Challenge. And it's open for all high school students at CMSA. At the beginning of the year, um, we do tryouts and getting the teams up to 10 students and then work on the robot, making designs, building. These students are responsible for the building the robot, designing, and also the competing. All right. Now, is it taking a break right here? You're kind of getting it up and running again? Here. I know that you're over there, Rashan, looking at it, so I thought, oh, maybe. So before we go, I just have to give everybody credit here. So just say your name very quickly so that po folks know who you are. Uh, my name is uh, Justiniano. Uh, my name is Gustavo. My name is Christian. OK. And then I'm running all the way over here. My name is Eric. My name's Lance. All right. Well, hey. Good luck to all of you as you compete. Bring Thank home the championship, right? Okay, excellent. So if you want to watch the team in action, they're going to be competing at the First Tech Challenge World Championships from April 22nd through the 25th at America Center in St. Louis, Missouri. For more information about the team and First Tech Challenge, you can find it online, abc7chicago.com. Thank you, thank you, thank you.